Good evening. It's no secret that Central Avenue in Albuquerque has its share of homeless people. But now UNM students say it's becoming a problem on campus and they want the university to do something about it. News 13's Marissa Lucero has details. During the day, life on UNM campus can be busy. It settles down in the evening and at night. It's unsafe. It's very dangerous. There's definitely been an increase in the population. Students say they're seeing more and more homeless people hanging around their dorms. I get asked all the time, like, oh, do you have any spare change? And I usually don't. Oh, do you have money you can spare? Do you have food you can spare? And a bigger question could be even, like, do you have alcohol on you? More than 2,500 students live on campus within seven different dorms. All of them are located on the main campus around Johnson Field. UNM is a public campus and it happens to sit along one of the busiest streets in the city, Central Avenue. Even just like touring during the day with my dad, like there were like a good like 10, 15, just like walking around, like laying down on the ground. And I was like, wow, like this is a culture shock. Like it was just almost overwhelming. One student even wrote a letter last week addressing the administration, asking that UNM police step up patrols at night and even consider putting in a chain link fence along the southeast corner of campus near the dorms because students say it's becoming too risky to be out on campus at night. We pay a lot of money to live on campus, to be on campus, and the fact that we have to have these confrontations is unfortunate. Marissa Lucero, KRQE News 13. UNM could not tell us if putting a chain link fence along Girard is an option. UNM police say officers do building checks early in the morning and late at night. They also offer to take the homeless people to shelters in the area when they find them sleeping on campus.